Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you how to control the gas pedal. In this video, I'll be going over some simple steps to allow you to be better at controlling the gas pedal, whether you're driving an automatic car or a manual car. Now let's get right to it. Just for the record, this car is automatic, but these steps can also be used and slightly modified to work for a manual car. First and foremost, let's take a look down there. You can see that we have the gas pedal right over here. So it's important to know where your gas pedal is. This is the gas pedal right over here. When you press it, you'll know it's the right one and, and make sure you're in park if you're in, a, if you're in an automatic car or neutral with the parking brake engaged if you're in a manual car. When you press it, you're going to actually hear the engine revving and you'll see the tachometer moving. Just like that. So the first thing that you want to do is obviously just press it and just, just, just rev it a little bit. And, you know, I would recommend doing this in a pretty empty parking lot, just like I'm doing right here. Um, just because you don't want to be disturbing anybody on any streets. Um, and try and do it during off hours, like when not many people would be around. So you want to actually just rev it and get a feel for it. So you want to just continue to rev the, the engine and push that gas pedal to get a feel for it. Now, the next thing that you want to do is you want to actually practice revving the engine and keeping it at certain rev points on the tachometer. So right here, as you can see, this is a tachometer. Okay, now this is a speedometer. This is a tachometer. It's important to know the difference. The tachometer basically measures the engine speed. So it tells you how fast your engine is, is revving, basically. Now what you want to do is you want to just barely press the gas pedal and just try and rev it and hold it somewhere. So I'm holding it. Let's try and hold it a little bit higher. We'll try and hold it right about here, about 1,500 RPMs and then release. Okay, now try revving it a little bit higher. I'm going to try holding it, let's say, at about 3,000 RPMs. And then release. And, and you want to keep doing this. You want to keep practicing holding it at different RPMs. Because that's going to give you um, a better gauge of how to properly rev that gas pedal. Okay. Now, what I'm going to do next is I'm actually going to take the camera. I'm going to mount it right over here on this window. Just like this. So you can see me. And then I'll tell you exactly what to do for the next steps. So first and foremost, when you're controlling the gas pedal... Um, what, what a lot of beginner drivers do and you want to avoid doing this is they I'm just trying to hook this on so it doesn't rev, it doesn't rattle against the camera um, They just push the gas pedal, you know, and they continue pressing it now The key for controlling the gas pedal is to press it a little bit and continue pressing it until you get the Acceleration that you want and then hold it there most beginner drivers will just go like this until they floor it and then they realize, wow, that's too much acceleration. So they completely release it. And that's why it's a very rough motion at the start. But what you want to do is you want to press it, continually press it. And when you get that acceleration level that you want, hold it there. Don't continue pressing it more. So this is what we're going to do. You want to go to an empty parking lot just like this during off hours. And you want to get ready to practice. Now, if you're driving an automatic car, you're going to put your foot on the brake, put it in drive, and then you're going to release the parking brake if it's been engaged. If you're driving a manual car, you obviously want to put it in first gear and use the clutch balance, clutch gas balance to actually get the car moving. But what you want to do is you want to just practice pressing the gas a little bit. Start off by pressing the gas just a little bit, okay? Now I'm going to just release the brake pedal, pressing the gas a little bit, and I'm holding it there. Now I'm going to brake, okay? So what I did there is I pressed the gas pedal and I held it at the level that I wanted to, and I, and I held it there. So I'm gonna go in reverse and I'll show you what would happen if I continued pressing the gas pedal, which is not what you wanna do. And I would recommend that you do this in a safe environment or safe situation, because it's good to know what not to do in order to know what you should do. So I'm putting the car in drive. This is what would happen if I pressed the gas pedal and I did, as I said, many beginner drivers do, I just continued to continue to, to press it. So I'm gonna press the gas pedal and I'm gonna to continue to to press it down even further. So I'm pressing the gas pedal and pressing down even further, 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 and now I'm going way too fast. I'm going past the acceleration that I need, okay? So once again, I would recommend even trying this in reverse, but before you try it in reverse, not, not pressing it hard, but pressing the gas pedal slightly in reverse. Before you go in reverse, make sure you've done all your safety checks. Make sure that you're not gonna, you know, uh, encounter any cars, any pedestrians, any light posts, any anything at all. So I'm gonna put it in reverse now, it's already in reverse. I'm gonna press the gas pedal when I'm moving back, and I'm gonna hold the gas pedal here. I'm now accelerating in reverse at a slight acceleration level that I want. Now I'm gonna press the brake pedal again, okay? So you want to literally just keep doing this. Put it in drive, go forward, press the gas pedal a little bit, and continue pressing it until you get enough acceleration that you want, and then hold it there. So I'm pressing the gas pedal, 
and I'm holding it here because this is the acceleration that I want. Now I'm braking and I'm coming to a complete stop. I'm gonna put it in reverse, do the exact same thing. Press the gas pedal, a little bit more. This is the acceleration that I want. I'm holding it here. Then I'm gonna brake, come to a nice, complete, smooth stop. Do the exact same thing. And that's the best way to learn how to control the gas pedal. First and foremost, you need to understand how it works. You wanna press it down and continue pressing it until you get the acceleration and then hold it there. Don't continue going past that because what's gonna happen is you're gonna accelerate even more, which is more acceleration than you want. So press it and then hold it there, okay? Wherever, whatever acceleration level you want, whether it's a little bit or a little bit more, hold it there once you reach that acceleration feeling that you want, okay? Do it in drive and reverse. Once you understand how to do it and you practice, you'll be good to go. And that's basically it. In this video, I've shown you how to control the gas pedal. I've taken the camera, I've shown you the gas pedal, I've told you exactly what you should do with your foot, and I've shown you some practice drills and exercises that you can use to get better at controlling that gas pedal. Now, the more that you practice, the better that you'll be. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. What are some other tips for controlling the gas pedal properly? Let me know as a comment down below, and of course, be sure to subscribe for more great car and driving videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.